دولت فدرال کسومالیا ایا حریر ک دیپلماسی دید اجرت دولت کینیا ایا دوکو ای دی سی حد گذبی جوکت آه او ایکو سامین ایسو مذاح بنانی ده ای قرن مذا سومالیا سومالیا ایا شکتی این دمان دیپلماسی این تی دکلا صبح ایسو دل ک کینیا و اینو کو آمرتی این ایکو و کینیا دل ک اوج بحان تضو معلومات گذوه ده او کبیلا و نیساشن ای تبان ک دسامبر و مان تو کو بگن قرار لغو بهی و بهین تو دولت ده ایا لغو یری دولت ده فدرال ک سومالیا ایا دو ک دولت ایسو مذاح بنانی ده ده قرن نمو او دمان اتقاضه ی حیر ک ای قانون ک عالمی گه گودن ایس واجب که دستوری گاهه که سران اعلان تمدن مدا قرن نمدا ای حسیلونه د دلک و عجو آن سطح این حیر که دبلوماسی دید ای اجرت دولت دکینیا دولت فدرال کسومالی و عجو یرن ایس دمان دبلوماسی این تدا کج جوگ کینیا این ای دب اجو صلابتان دلک هدا و حین کو امر ایس کو حال کن کج جوگ دولت دکینیا این دلک اوج بحان مدت تضو مال مدا اوک بلاون ایس شنی تبان ک دسامبر آمان تو کوبیگن ایا لجوی رقرال ک قرال كاية انتا سيكود دري ان دولد سومالي ايو اركت شعب كا كينيا انو يهي شعب جعل نبادا ايو وضا نولان شيها شعوب تاق قبل كا اي نكالا دحي سو شعب كا سومالي يد حرير قطور دير او كود لسان دريس وناك ايو حو وضا قبسي بلسي هوغان كا مانتا ايو دولد كينيا ايو هورو كينياتو او هوغامين ايو او كشقين ايو كالا فوغين تا لبادا شعب ايو دن وداك تا اه دولد سومالي ايو حي سودو كالا شاكت سی ایوگا جواب تا حد گذبیه د سیاست داد ای فرقلین تقاون از دوچوگا مدوین کی وجود دن بیه دولت دکین یا یکوی سی مذاح بنانه د دل کنا دولت فدرال کا وحی حقیقی نه سام مذاح بنانه د قرن نمدا ای مد نمدا امدا سومالیت سی وافقان دستور کد دل کا شروع د ای حرار ک عالمیگا وحجر گرتن آنا هوای راتی دولت دو کم جلی سحوریه د مذاح بنانه د ای قرن نمدا سومالیت ایا لوجی رقرال کا گاهان کن آیا یه مدت معلوم اون کدیب مرکی دولت دکین یا ایدل که دکو عصوم تیم دخونه سومالی لان موسبیه عبدی که از سال سنین تیلا صرافی نیرو به کل کل می مدخونه ایدل که کین یا اهورو کینیاتا وزیر کورفافین تو دولت سومالی عثمان دوبه آیا فافاهی نیا سبب تو دولت سومالی ایحیر که اوجرت دولت دکین یا دولت فدرال ک سومالی یه دو کد دولی سمت دخپنانی ده دخرن او دمانت قاضی ایحیر که یه قینو ک عالمی کرد. کودن ایسلا و اچبات که در دستور گاهی کسران ایرانی تمدن نمدا قرن نمدا یه حسلونی در دل کم و حاکی کو آن سطحی این حیر که دوبل مسیریت و چرتو دولت دکینه دولت فدرال کس سومالیا و حاکی آن ایسلا دمان دوبل مسیریت یه دکه چوگه کینیا این دل که دیبوکو سالاب تان و حاینا کو آمر ایسلا کو هل کن که چوگه دولت دکینیا این دل که کجا بحان مدت دوام مال مودا و کبیل آبان ایسلا عاوا و بیش از هی شن یه توان که دسامبر لب کن یه لب عتن شعب کینیا دولت فدرال کس سومالیا و حیو آرکت شعب کینیا اینو یه هی شعب چهل نبود یه وضع نورش آش شعب تقبل که هی نکلر حیصو شعب کس سومالیه حیر قطر دیر و کل سن دریس و نگ یه وحی وضع قبضی بلسه هوگان کمان تی دولت کینیا و کش قین ایو کل فوجین ته لب د شعب یه دو وضعت ته سبب تو گوانگ. دولت فدرال کس سومالیا و حیوگر تو گوانگ کن سعی و گچ و ابتو حد گذبیه د سیاست داد یه فرقلین تقاون استفاده چوگه ام دو اینکی و گودم بیای ای دولت دکین یا که هیسی مذاح بنانه د دل کن. و گودم باین. دولت فدرال کس سومالیا و حی حقیقی نیست. مذاح بنانه دا قرن نمدا یه مدن نمدا و مدت سومالیا. سعی و فقسن دستور کدال ک. شروع دا یه حیر ک عالمی گه و حقیر قرط نانا هوای رتی دولت دو کمی جلیسو حریت دا مذاح بنانی دا یه قرن نمدا و مدت سومالی. Good afternoon everybody. Well, I just want to take this opportunity to first and foremost thank my brother President Famajo for accepting our invitation to come and. join us at the population conference that has just concluded. We are grateful and I think we have had three days of uh, very interesting debate and I believe with positive outcomes. We've also had the opportunity to engage with my brother on issues bilateral and uh, I must indeed say and thank my brother because we have had very, very fruitful deliberations 
And the most important thing is uh, we have come to an understanding that there can be no greater relationship that between the, than, than that of neighbors, of people who have been put together, not out of choice, but by the will of God. And therefore it is important for us, as people of one region, as neighbors, and people who have uh, uh, a lot of cultural similarities, to ensure that our relationship is always at its best. Unfortunately, uh, over the last uh, couple of months, you know, we have had uh, certain issues that have strained our relationship. But today we have agreed with my brother that there is need for us to ensure we bring normality to our relationship. We bring sensibility back to our relationship. And as brothers who may disagree from time to time, but families always find a way of resolving their problems in a peaceful manner. So we agreed that from now onwards we must do everything we can, especially as leaders, to ensure that our people live peacefully, they live happily, and we are able to work together because ultimately we are one people. So after lengthy discussions, which we have said we will continue, there were a number of issues that uh, President Famajo also raised with me that were of concern. And indeed, I have agreed that uh, some of those issues we shall deal with uh, immediately. First and foremost, we have said uh, that um, previously, before all these uh, issues, our brothers and sisters from Somalia were able to come to Kenya and get visas on arrival. But now, uh, apparently, visas have now been referred back to um, the uh, embassy in Mogadishu. So we have said that with immediate effect, we go back to normality and uh, our brothers and sisters from Somalia will be able to obtain their visas at the airport when they arrive. So no more referral visas. We go back and uh, we want to encourage our people to do business. We want to encourage our people to come and visit their friends and family. That is what is important, and we don't want any obstacles to that partnership. I think secondly, we have also discussed the issues about flights from Magadishu into Nairobi, because now apparently they're going through Wajir, and we have agreed that within a week, the necessary authorities should put in place that which is necessary to ensure that we now have direct flights once again from Magadishu to Nairobi. On all the other issues we have agreed as brothers will do, we will sit and continue our discussions and we find solutions that are beneficial to both our countries, to both our peoples, and that will encourage and develop and grow the prosperity of our people and the brotherhood that should exist amongst neighbors. So with those few remarks, my brother, once again, thank you for accepting our invitation. We're happy to have you. We hope you will be a much more regular visitor I look forward to seeing you in Mogadishu soon as well. And uh, I am sure that with this renewed uh, goodwill between us, I am sure we will find mutually acceptable solutions that will allow our two countries and our region to grow and to prosper and for us to cherish the peace and stability that I think we both truly, truly desire. Thank you and uh, God bless you all. Karibu, my brother. Thank you. Good evening. Thank you, my brother, for your warm welcome and hospitality according to me and my delegation. I always enjoy to, to, to be here. And I have to also admit that, uh, honestly, you are a very humble man and down to earth to visit at my residence. Thank you for that. I really appreciate it. Also, I wanted to thank you, uh, Mr. President, and uh, the government, your government, and the people of uh, Kenya, uh, for your contribution, for your contribution in the peace and security in Somalia. Of course, Kenya is part of AMSOM, who lost a lot of good men and women 
in fighting against al-Shabaab and the terrorist organization. I will assure you their sacrifice will not go in vain, will not go in vain. Also, I wanted to thank your government and the people of Kenya for hosting thousands of Somali families who successfully work here, do business, and raise their family peacefully. We always appreciate that. Kenya and Somalia definitely has developed a close ties and historic relationship which based on mutual respect and equal, equal footing, and we always appreciate. As you said, uh, we discussed on several issues, including uh, to reinstate the direct flights from Mogadishu directly to uh, Nairobi and to stop the, the, uh, the Wajir uh, stopover. We really appreciate. Also, we uh, agree that uh, to issue visa on arrival, particularly our public officials who come here for government business, we also appreciate. We have a lot of things in common.